Hey there YouTubers, JB Coins here with another video. This is an unwrapping obviously. Uh, this is something I've been waiting for for a while and uh, uh, finally found one that was reasonably priced. So I'm kind of excited to open this up. Camera Girl and I are not wealthy people so we can't afford by unfortunately what I'm about to show you in like the original you know mint state and all that kind of stuff so what I have wow this guy really packed this thing <laughs> sorry guys um, good lord Now maybe it'll come out, or not. There it is. Okay, like it says on here, this is a replica of America's first coin that was designed by Benjamin Franklin. And this is the coin itself in the corner. And the coin is called a Fugio, F-U-G-I-O by collectors, uh, because the, the word Fugio is written on the on the uh, backside and it says it means time flies. The other thing that it says on here is we are one. And what I really like about the coin is 1787. Ben Franklin presented one of these to uh, George Washington. I read their biographies and George Washington was not he didn't want to be on any of the money for one thing. He didn't want to follow in, in the king's uh, style of doing things. So Ben Franklin was tasked with making a coin that didn't have George Washington on it, but put his values and the colonial values into that first coin. So this coin, or a coin just like this, uh, there's actually one out there right now that is purported to be the first coin that was handed to George Washington by Ben Franklin. Um, and it says Fugio on here, 1787. And this is what I love, mind your business. Now mind your business today, we think mind your own business. That's not what it meant in 1787. In 1787, it was tend to your business, mind your business, keep your mind on your business, that type of thing. Um, focus on what you need to do. Uh, ben Franklin and George Washington both were very, very fixed on achieving what they set out to do, obviously. Um, I saw one report that in today's dollars, George Washington was worth approximately $550 million today's money. Obviously a lot less money back then dollar-wise, but that would be the equivalent if he was alive today. So, I mean, this is just a really cool coin to me because it's, it's a copy of the first coin. Uh, we got this off of eBay. Um, there are more of these out there. And this is actually a coin that I, that I kind of, I would like to put this into an airtight and carry it with me as a constant reminder to mind my business. Um, and it's a very cool conversation piece too. It's just, it's just a neat thing. And the fact that they've got the history on this one is, is really cool. Now there are some older replicas that are selling for 70, 80 bucks in various condition. Uh, and there are some real ones that are, that are extremely expensive, but in really poor shape. Um, you know, if you're going to get one of these, you're going to spend millions of dollars if it's the real deal and in that kind of condition. So I like this because it's a brand new replica. It's in, it's in clear print state. So I can actually look at it, show it and people can read it but it's very clearly a replica, okay? Uh, thought you guys would find this interesting. I just think it's the cool, it's really cool. Um, and I really thank Camera Girl for getting this for me because I've been wanting it for a couple of years. <laughs> so until next time, check out our website, check the links below the video. There's a drop down there uh, that says uh, more. Um, you pull that down and, and, and it'll show you links to the website 
links to some of the products that we use that you guys ask questions about. Uh, and uh, of course, the website has lots more information too. So until next time, continue to like, share, subscribe, comment, and uh, JB Coins signing off.